Hey Sagittarius, Amber Dawn here. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe and push the like button. I am going to make this video a little bit quicker than normal, mainly because Sagittariuses don't typically watch these videos anyway, so I'll just keep it kind of short, quick and sweet. But this is gonna be focused on kind of you versus your person. So it's more of a love reading. Um, yeah, so if you're not here for a love reading, then just go ahead and click off. I'm going to be doing more readings just on general readings because not everybody likes love readings. I know I don't always like love, love readings. It gets a little annoying when you're not in love, you're not involved with love, but yet all these readings are about love. I totally get it. So anyway, Sagittarius, let's get this going. Let's get this going, Sag. All right, I don't know what that is. Okay, let's start this timer. All right, so Sagittarius. Let's see what Sagittarius is feeling about their person. Eight of Swords, Jesus, Five of Pentacles. Why are all of these readings so negative this month? It's very strange, I don't get it. I don't get it. Two of Cups. Okay, and their person, let's see, let's do a shuffle. So with you, it looks like you're just kind of like, maybe feeling like they might not be that interested in you. Um, maybe you're not that, no, this is you. So yeah, so what I'm feeling off of this is that you just don't feel like they're giving you the attention or the time that you want. Um, and it's kind of making you feel like, what? what's the point then? Like, I'm a Sagittarius, you know what I mean? Like, you, you either come correct and work this out or get it the hell out. I got more important things to do. That's like a Sagittarius mentality, you know? They have Six of Swords. So they're trying to walk away from some mental burdens. Six of cups and then four of cups. So they want stability with you. Um, it just, yeah, we're gonna clarify this. So they want stability, but it almost looks like they are afraid of stagnancy if they have stability. You could be dealing with another Sag, because I know Sages are kind of like like that. Like they don't, they, they like stability, but they don't want stagnancy. And that's kind of what I'm feeling off this person. So let's clarify Eight of Swords for Sagittarius. Eight of Swords for Sag. All right, Sagis. Sagis, Wagis. Okay. Eight of Swords is with the Ace of Cups. Ace of Pentacles and Ace of Swords. Wow, lots of aces. This might be a new relationship. <clears throat> and you're kind of all up in your head about it. You're not sure what to think about it. Because they're not giving you the attention that you want. Let's clarify the Five of Pentacles, please. Hierophant. Wheel of Fortune, Six of Pentacles. This could be somebody that you relate to or you look highly to. You look kind of up to them because they're wise. Um, you see a future with them. You see, and, and, it, and it feels karmic to me, like you guys are here to learn lessons off of each other. They might be breadcrumbing you a little bit though. And so that might be why you feel like kind of out in the cold with this person. I'm just gonna clarify all your cards. Two of cups, please. Seven of wands, there could be arguing. Uh, you got the tower, 
And the Five of Swords. Ooh. So you guys might have gotten into an argument about um, how they're not putting in their time. And that kind of caused a tower moment to where you might not be talking right now. <clears throat> and it's like you're feeling a little bit defeated in the situation. What is your person? Let's see. Let's clarify the Six of Swords for your person. Six of Swords, Spirit, please. Six of Swords. I'm just going to cut it twice. Whoa. Nine of Swords. They're... You might be dealing with an air sign, too. If they're an air sign, then they're overthinking everything. If they're not, they're still overthinking everything. They just want... It's almost like they're trying to come up with a solution so that they can have success with you. <clears throat> yeah, they definitely want to stick it in you if you're a girl or you want to stick it in them if you're a dude. Um, yeah, so they want success and they're they're really thinking about like, what do I have to do to balance this out and make Sagittarius happy, you know? So, so far it looks like they do want this with you. Queen of Pentacles is verifying... Um, Six of Cups, clarifying, not verifying. The Hermit, King of Swords. So they, they want to communicate with you. Um, they do see, see abundance with you. They, they Like this is actually a good reading. So if you're worried about your person and if they're not interested, they are interested. Um, they're just trying to go about this, this in a... They're trying to think about it. They're in a hermit mode. Maybe they've pulled away a little bit. Maybe after the tower moment or some kind of disagreement, they they backed off a little bit. But the only reason why they backed off is so that they can go within and figure out what they can do to make you happy, what they can change. I'm not even going to verify. Uh, why do I keep saying verify? Clarify. I'm not going to clarify four of cups. I'm already seeing this person as being very interested in you. So let's see what's going to happen in the future between these two. Future for Sagittarius. Future for Sag. Okay. Sag. Ace of Pentacles. An offer judgment okay and five of wands competition huh that threw me off okay so you might have people fighting over you there might be multiple suitors that are interested in you yeah seven of cups in the future this is the future sorry if you can hear like cars and stuff. I have my window open. It's very hot in here. Yeah, right after I said you're going to have people fighting over you, you got the seven of cups, which means multiple options. Interesting, Saggy. Well, Sagis are so like fun and very attractive, you know, your energies are, are very attractive. All right, so let's get a few more cards on your side. I have a feeling this reading isn't going to be as fast as I was hoping, but that's okay. We'll go with it. The Fool, Four of Wands, Page of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles. Yeah, there's an offer coming in. There is an offer of commitment coming in. Let's get three more on Sage's side. The Empress. Oh my gosh, Eight of Wands. This is the this is the first good reading we've had from all the signs so far. That's awesome. Finally, hopefully it breaks the the negativity. The Wheel of Fortune. Look at that. Yeah, you're going to have an offer coming in. You're going to have like Straight communication, quick communication. 
they want to be with the empress whether you're male or female they want to be with that all loving caring person that you are they're going to offer it i know that's on your side so you could be doing the offering to them possibly all right let's get energy on their side in the future six of pentacles the tower two of swords okay All right, I'm going to I'm going to just pull a couple more. <laughs> so you could be give, giving an offer to them or you could be getting offers from somebody else because you have many suitors interested. <clears throat> I guess I'll take that. Um 5 of cups. Okay. Knight of pentacles. 6 of swords. Whoa, I don't know. Okay. On your end, it's looking good. On their end is like confusion. Uh -huh. Running away from their, their thoughts, not wanting to deal with it. On your end, so you might be giving them an ultimatum. There's a couple stories playing out in this right now. So you're going to either be getting offers from other people and you're going to accept one of them. Because it, it all this is good on your side. So no matter what, even if this person isn't in the picture in the future, you're still going to be totally fine. Like you're going to find someone. There's some, the person that's meant for you or somebody that you're going to enjoy. They're going to be coming in hot. Um, but on their end, it's like wishy-washy, not sure what to do. Yeah, two of wands, unable to make a decision. And they have this two of swords. The moon, they have secrets. Ace of swords, they're going to make a final judgment call, a final decision. Yeah, I'm not sure if it's going to be this person, Sag. I hope that doesn't hurt your feelings or that's not something you didn't want to hear, you, you know. Injustice. So no matter what, what I'm feeling with this justice card is no matter what happens, even if it's not with this person, you're still going to be very happy in the end. So don't worry if it's not this person coming in. Everything's going to be gravy. Let's get some uh, cards from the situation set for Sagittarius. Lost sold yeah I think this person's lost and, and not really sure what they want to do maybe because they're moving they might be moving and they're like I can't give you what you want because I'm literally moving could be that um, I can see you know what you want you know you're like either you're in or you're out that's what I feel off that but if they're out someone else is coming in quick insatiable commitment long term crushed sad broken feeling alone hamster wheel doing things over and over again roller coaster a high adrenaline rush Whoop. Waves coming and going, running, avoiding. So, yeah, I, from what I'm feeling off of this reading, tragedy, forbidden love. From what I'm feeling in this current energy, things can change. But I'm feeling like I already said, you would like something with them, but they're not quite giving you what you want. And so you're going to be moving away from them. Like... They might be moving literally away from you, which is why they can't give you what you want. But no matter what, I don't see a commitment happening with this person. It's going to be somebody else. It's going to be somebody else and it's going to be, there's going to be a commitment and it's going to be equal, give and take. This other person's going to hear about it and they're going to be super sad about it. Um, 
they're gonna go through all these emotions highs and lows only because you've moved on and they're like wait what about me well you weren't in it and so I had to go you know I got time for this and nobody got time for that and um yeah so that's pretty much what I see so whoever this new person is they're gonna be um, all in and ready to be in a good nice commitment solid foundation with you all right so let me know if that resonated um i hope you guys are doing well and we'll see you next time bye sag Mwah.